I just wanted to pop back in with a little bit of news updates. So Druids ended up winning the title on, not the title, but the playoffs on penalties against, uh, what was the name of that club? Uh, Thomas Key. Yep, that was it. Uh, Jack Jones won the player of the year for the league. So that was great. Uh, he also was the top goal scorer. Richard Power, 19 goals in the league, 24 for Jones. Jones was also the young player of the year. And we had, uh, well, he was, look at the, look at the number of Saints. Oh my God. That's just disgusting. <laughs> so anyway, wanted to point that out. Also, we got our uh, budget in. So $61,000 transfer budget, one and a half million dollar payroll budget that we can't spend because we don't have we don't have we don't have the income to offset that uh, so we've still got to be fiscally responsible uh, we have signed a few new contracts putting us back up over 400,000 but we're going to shave about a hundred and forty thousand off our current spending uh, all of our loan guys are leaving and I believe Matthew Thomas is gone Ken Tipton, we're going to let him go. Uh, Alan Bennett, well, I mean, he is a legend. He is only 29. He's making 26000 Fringe player. Maybe he'll take less money. Can I get him at current contract? All right, we'll sign him for one more year. Just because he's a, a legend. Alan Bennett's going to be gone. Owen Bamford's going to be gone. Guy Holt's going to be gone. Ollie Woods is leaving. Palfreyman, I'm going to let go. Jamo, I'm going to let go. Kevin Turner, all of our loan guys are going to be gone. So we're losing all those guys. So that that's what we're going to have left. <laughs> is 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 from sermon on down. That's it. Uh, I don't think that's going to be enough to put a team on the field. Uh, let's see. If we go into our development center, do I keep him? He's Nigerian. That would be a foreign player. I think I could probably do better with a foreign player. These are English guys. Thomas... Yeah, I don't want to. I'm going to let him go. And we really don't have anybody else. So I'm going to have to. I'm probably going to have a busy, busy off season. So anyway, just wanted to show you guys what was going on with the uh, budgets for next year. And also uh, with Jack Jones, man, he racked up. All right, we'll see you for the transfers here in a little while. All right, just a quick update for you guys. We've got six new signings that have come in at the start of the transfer window. We'll look at these in a little more depth, but uh, you know they're all frees. Renee Ackerman, uh, expiring contract, three and a half star. Neil Crown, came, we uh, signed him. He was on loan with us last year. Uh, he comes in for twenty-one thousand a year. Anthony Humphreys, a center back. He's a big signing, 74,000, almost five stars, and he's a B plus. Uh, then Jimmy Cooper, a midfielder, uh, B minus, two and a half star. Danny Cunningham, a winger, three star, B minus, and Ray Doyle, and he's going to be the replacement for Hemmings, uh, 58,000, four and a half star, B plus. So... Very, very good player. He does have a buyout. Uh, so that's the six big signings that we've got. Uh, Kevin Turner, uh, we have lost to Druids on a free. And we are bringing this guy in to look at him on transfer. So just wanted to get you guys caught up with the transfer news. Again, we will 
jump in and look at those guys in a little more depth, where they came from, what they look like, what their ratings are, and everything else in a little while. Some more transfer news. We got a B rating from Marty Katon, a 20, a Katon, a 20 year old attacking midfielder. Uh, he can also play uh, the number 10 central mid. He can drop back to D mid a little bit, and he can also play up top. Now he's valued at 26 and a half thousand, three and a half star current, five star potential ability. And we paid out $35,000 for him. That's the first money signing I think I've done. And it's also a record transfer. Uh, previous record was 16,000 pounds, uh, $20,000. This is 15,000 US dollars more, uh, obviously. So uh, anyway, that is uh, big news happening in on our front. We've got a couple of guys in on uh, trial right now we're looking at. We've also picked up um, doo -doo -doo -doo. Daniel Evans, a 20-year-old midfielder, a 21-year-old midfielder from Bangor City. So, And we've got a couple of more loans that we're looking for, and these are all free guys. So uh, a couple of them are under 19s to give us enough players to fill that spot. So anyway, we'll be back uh, for more transfer news and the season. Hey guys, well, we are back. This is the official start of the episode. This is season four, episode one, climbing the ladder with Bala Town FC. We are back for at least one more season. Uh, we've been pretty busy, as you can see from the earlier information. Uh, we beat York City in a friendly 2-0. Phil Bird, Matt Turner with goals. Mickle over. We tried a new tactic. They crushed us 3-1. We were actually favored. We dominated the game statistically. And uh, just they made us pay. Uh, we went with another new tactic and won 7-1. Uh, that's against... Jan Rugg, United, Cole Saxton, Matt Turner, Ken Tipton, Declan McDonald with first half goals, Nick Ward with a second half brace in two minutes, and Anthony Champion with a goal as well. And then we beat Lex 6 1. Uh, Jimmy Cooper, Matt Turner, Phil Bird with a brace, Philip Johnson, and Anthony Humphreys with the goals. So let's take a look at a couple of things here. I want to see if Carl Scrona is underway yet. And they are. All right, so they're second, second table, uh, second half of the table, four points clear of relegation. So that's what's going on with them. Just wanted to check. And let's take a look at our transfer window. So first off, we are going to look at released players. And it's a pretty long list. Uh, some of these guys you won't recognize. Matthew Thomas uh, was the striker the first year of the save. Uh, he goes on a free. Owen Bamford, we had picked him up, and uh, he never really played. He goes on a free. Guy Holt, we had loaned him out for several years. He goes on a free. And Osaji Jamo, I wouldn't have minded keeping him, but he was a foreign player. And uh, so we let him go also on a free. I wonder if he signed anywhere. He has not. I think he could have done a job for us, but, you know, he's only 21, but not what I was actually looking for this year. Kevin Turner, we uh, send on a, uh, he goes out on a free to Druids. Uh, we did sell our uh, former starting keeper, uh, now our number two, Blaze Brownhill, goes to Colchester for $11,750. And I bit the bullet, and I sold Ralph Mondello, our starting star center back. He was a five-star to Jan Dudno uh, for a fee that will approach $135,000 with add-ons. I just couldn't afford to not take that deal. Uh, that's not what they offered. I did work them up from about 55,000 and when they took it I was like hell yeah yeah let's see all right so 
we've been busy. Now we brought in 95,000 in fees and we only spent 35. We spent all that on one player that you guys saw earlier. So let's take a look at him. Marty Catton, uh, 20 year old Welsh player, three and a half star current, five star potential. He can play a little defensive mid, uh, but he is a playmaker in the central mid, 13 passing. And that was something I wanted to make a concerted effort for. He could even move up and play striker if we need him to. Uh, but he's got pace, decision-making, uh, composure, flair, vision. He's got it all. I'm looking forward to him. You can see in the friendlies, uh, two assists playing almost an eight. So I think he's going to be brilliant for us this year. And he may not even be our number one center back. <laughs> this guy is Ray Doyle. But let's go down in order. Uh, Neil Crown comes from Kana Key. Uh, he's on a free right back. He can slide over to left back. Three stars. And yeah, he's just a, a well-rounded uh, Englishman. 29 years old. I believe he played for us last year. He did. We had him on loan from Connors Key. Played a 6.7. So we went ahead and brought him in. And uh, Renee Ackerman comes from Saints. We're taking a few of their handouts. Uh, so he is a right back. Uh, very good physicals. Four and a half star. Four and a quarter star potential. Uh, he can pass. You know, he's more of a winger. I think an attacking player. But good determination, good work rate. So I liked that. So we brought him in. And you can see in the friendlies, three starts, one reserve playing a 7-4-3. Then we move on to Ray Doyle from Sheffield Wednesday. This guy's going to probably be our starting uh, main starter, replacing Hemmings from last year. Hemmings, 7.7 with three assists in the early going. Uh, Five-star potential, four-star current. So I think he's a really good replacement. He is pretty expensive. Look at the passing, though. Again, I was looking at passing specifically this year. Decent dribbling, decent first touch, very good distribution. Uh, I think that's an upgrade big time for our central midfield. We then bring in Danny Cunningham from Jan Dudno on a free. He's a 26-year-old Welsh. Uh, three and a half star potential again very pacey uh, just you know he's an average average player but he's got decent crossing and dribbling so he could fit in on that wing out to the side Swindon Town we acquire 23 year old Jimmy Cooper he's a central mid and a right winger good first touch good heading decent passing uh, so he's going to be a reserve for us in the central mid Anthony Humphreys from Bristol City on a free left back. Uh, he can play center back and he can play it well, but he is a really good left back. He can't really cross, but we really he's going to be probably a force out there on the left side and add some more defense back there. Uh, so we'll see. We'll see where he slots in. Marty Catton we already looked at. We brought in a new number one keeper, Wong Chun Kwok. And that's what allowed us to get rid of Blaze Brownhill. Contrary to popular belief, he's Welsh. I certainly wasn't expecting that when I clicked on him the first time. But he is an upgrade at Keeper. Uh, and so we are very excited to bring him in. Uh, he is not wearing the number one because Sulman is. But Sulman just got hurt and is going to miss a little while. So Chun Kwok will be our number one keeper from day one. Lewis Pritchard from Newtown, another left winger, just a reserve, not very good. I actually signed him because he was 18, and we showed last year we need, had a need for uh, younger under-19 players. Jonathan Bennett from Bangor City comes in on loan. Oh, actually, Pritchard was a loan. Jonathan Bennett's also a loanee, uh, 21 years old, four-star. I had one tactic. And I still do that calls for a defensive mid, and I needed some depth there. And that's this guy's job. A pretty decent passer, and so he's going to fill the role there. Matt Turner from uh, New Saints. He's going to be a loney striker. Good finishing, decent pace, really good acceleration. And you saw he's already scored a couple of goals. So he is going to play 
the uh, Jones role from last year, hopefully scoring a lot of goals. Eamon Bimbe comes in from uh, Banger City on loan. Uh, he can play striker. Not great at finishing. He's more of a central mid. Again, good passing, good depth there in the central mid. Nathan Miller on a free from Newtown. He is 20 years old, left back. Uh, again, just to do the job, just some depth. And we just signed Ben Oakley on a free from Cardiff Met Uni. Uh, again, right winger, central mid. He's got decent passing, crossing, dribbling, so he could play that winger role. He is 30. Both of these guys were later in the window, uh, right towards the end, and just more for depth. So that is what we've got. So today we are back for the Welsh League Cup second round against newly promoted Colwyn Bay. Uh, then we have Connors Key, and then we'll play Colwyn Bay again. That one will be off camera. So let's take a look at the tactics as well. Uh, so Colwyn Bay, we actually must have played them at the lower level an awful lot during that 30-year pre-sim that, uh, that I had done because you can see they've got well over 100 matches here. Uh, so let's get into this. We are at home. We are favored. So this tactic you should recognize. This is the tactic we ran with last year. And I was looking for some things to... So this is going to be our home tactic and then our away tactic or our home tactic against harder teams will either be this tactic with two up top or this one here. This is the tactic that we played in that second friendly where we got upset. This is the one that we played in two of the matches. So I'm leaning towards this one. But being that we're home favorites today, we're going to go there. And we're going to go there. So we've got uh, Chun Kwok in the goal. Ackerman on the right. Wilson on the left. Humphreys and Saxton in the middle. Um, see, this is... he's Well, you know what? He is better at attacking. He is better at attacking. So maybe that is where we go. What I was leaning was playing Humphreys out here, then Declan in the middle. Saxton and Declan. Declan is blue, so he's better in the air. A little bit better speed. Central defender, defend. Better, he's better at heading, better marking, better tackling. All right, so we're going to give Saxton the shot. He's 23. They're both 23. McDonald, though, boy, for a two finishing, he scores a lot of goals. <laughs> I don't know how I feel about that, but we'll go with this. We've got Cooper out to the right. Jimmy Cooper is a new player, uh, but he is a new player of ours. Matty Catton. Is Cooper on the field because he is a... I don't know if we have to have 19-year-olds here. Oh, well, we're going to go with it. Catton and Doyle in the center mid. Looking, I'm very excited to see that partnership develop. All right, morale boost, first match of the season. Morale's, yeah, morale's a little off. And we are in red today. Oh, Ackerman with a shot block. Let's get creative. All right, a couple of shots off target. They are inspired. All right, Colwyn Bay gets the highlight. Pretty solid defense. Oh, he steals it. Doyle, and he is up the sideline. Cuts it inside. Oh, poor finish. Poor finish. But that's why he's a central midfielder, not a, uh, not a striker. So we need to do a little bit better there. We might have to go and tweak these a little bit. Maybe to... Um, 
Oh, what was that? Oh, that was a horrible. <laughs> I don't even think he was in the same zip code. Oh, a couple of good headers there. Nice job by the back line. Over the top, I-4. Oh, he was tackled hard. Cooper's there. And it goes out for a corner. Demand more. Doyle back out to Ackerman. Uh, into the legs of the defense twice. Couple of bookings on their side. Oh, Doyle pounces again. Find your man. Oh, plays it through to I-4. Across the keeper. And our first goal of the season is Owain I-4. Ray Doyle, our new signing with the first assist of the season. And we're up 1-0 on Colwyn Bay. First shot on target out of seven. I'd like a little bit better than that. Um, encourage the players. Cooper and Catton. All right, let's go pop in on our tactic here just for a minute. Where is... Did I let our other guy go? I don't think I did. Where's he at? I don't see him. I-4 was not our number two striker last year. I thought I signed that guy. All right, now I'm going to have to go look. That's freaking me out. All right, but anyway, if we're here, we want slightly lower tempo. Let's try that. We're doing what I want there. And I did switch to regroup. All right, uh, let's see. No reaction, start the second half. Now, now I'm drawing a blank, and I just noticed I'm kind of leaning off camera. We had the guy that was on loan from... from uh, But I'm trying to remember. Uh, I can't even remember now. I'm thinking we're going to have to take off. Is it maybe pass into space? Oh, there's a nice ball in. Turner. Oh, he was looking to cross the keeper up too. Demand more. Oh, they're pressured now. Wilson into the box. Lumped out. Oh, perfect pass. House out wide. Oh, nice job. Nice job on the defense. Don't lose it there. All right, he plays it deep. It's I-4. He chests it down. And it trickled past the keeper. Oh, by the way, last episode, what did you guys think of that non-goal? I went back and looked at it. I do not think he was offsides. That goal right there reminded me of that play. I think we got hosed. I think we got hosed big time. All right, we're going to give him some praise here. I-4 with a brace here in the in the first game of the season. Johnson pounces on the mistake. He plays it through. There's I-4. Uh, if he would have played it back over to the six-yard box, that probably would have been another goal. All right. Um, Jimmy Cooper... Let's bring Ackerman up there. We can move Lewis to the other side and then bring Ollie Woods on. Catton is struggling a little bit. 
And let's let's give uh, let's give Bimbe his debut. I'm feeling that. If only we could head the ball to our own team. We are playing really good defense. Wilson. He holds it up, finds a little more space, plays it back to Doyle. A uh, deep ball out to Ackerman. Laid off to Cooper. Oh, there it is. Look at the touch. Oh, Wayne, I-4, he's got a hat trick in the opening match of the season. I may not be worried about who that other guy is at this point. Because I-4 was our third or fourth striker option last year. And I thought I kept that other guy. Oh, that should have been another goal right there. Doyle plays it out to Johnson. A little bit of a block there. Had a little bit of a stutter in the frame. All right, Ackerman into the box. Humphreys. I think Declan McDonald might have scored that one. What do you guys think? All right, I believe Humphreys. Let's bring McDonald on for him. Both of those guys are playing real well at the center back position. Wow, they've got, look at the passing there. Gee whiz. Nash, poor finish. Uh, let's concentrate. They're overwhelmed by that. That's all right, though. Come on, boys. All right, into the center. Good save. Good save by our non-Chinese keeper, whose name escapes me at this moment. <laughs> Sexton heads it out. What is his name? Chun Kwok. I will never remember that, I'm afraid. Oh, Doyle. Oh, Doyle's taken down. Uh, we were getting ready to go on the counter. All right, they get another. Oh, there's a nice, nice header by Zach Wardley. Oh, I'm sorry, it was Saunders. Zach Wardley, is that our guy? Is that the guy we used to have the, for like the first year? Oh, he just drifted back into space. Brilliant header. Good job. Let's not let this get away from us here, fellas. All right, Wilson heads it out. Now Sexton puts it right to the other team. That's a nice ball. And it goes wide, but again, we get a header and it goes right to the other club. What the hell? Let's tell him to tighten up here. All right, there's a nice header. Johnson Woods. Ah. That was our new guy right there, Bimba. Don't foul him in the box. Oh, my God. All right, we're going to drop back to cautious now. Six out of 20. I'm not not pleased with that. Wilson. What the hell was that, guys? Oh, no, he had it. He had it. Oh, no. I thought he made a... Brilliant save there. What the hell happened? It's like he pushed it into the bar and it bounced back to him. He was trying to carry it and it, oh. Extra 
time. A 90th minute goal and a stoppage time goal. Three goals in four. Oh my God. Aggressive. I appreciate the effort. Midfield. And attack. Do we get one more sub? I don't think so. Let's put, no, no more substitutions. And that's fine. That is fine. I always check just to make sure because sometimes you never know. Oh, <laughs> I just saw the play and it made me think about it. It's Bird. And he is still on the team, but he must not have been put on the bench. Doyle. Uh, through. Oh, there it is. Offsides. Yep. Ugh. I'm going to drop back to cautious. In the box. You're fucking kidding me. Oh, a save. Oh, that makes up for the own goal pretty much. Not really because we would have won the game. But that kept us in the game. All right, push out. Push out. All right. Show some passion. There's Wardley. Doyle steals it. Into the box. And he puts it right at the keeper. All right. I think I'm going to have to look at him. Speaking of Wardley. Yes, that was our guy. I thought so. He just never played for us. Went to Colwyn Bay on a free. All right. Chun Kwok controls the ball. We've got one minute in the half of stop of extra time. Oh, Doyle pounces through ball. I four is there. Oh, he missed it. Oh, that should have been a fourth. That should have been a fourth. Take the shot. That goes high. All right. Um, I'm going to take off pass into space. Now, let's leave that. I'm going to drop that and then raise tempo. So shorter passing. Maybe that'll... Man, we are dying here. All right. There's a good header out. Can't get to it. This is not how you want to start your... Oh, my God. We got beaten there. Keeper was devastated off the line. 9 of 26. 9 chances. Um, No, we, we're going to penalties. I let them... All right, who do we got? We got McDonald, Doyle... And a bunch of nobodies. Ah, uh, who is this guy? I can't click on him. All right. Oh, it's not Declan. It's Doyle. Oh, that's a nice finish there. 
Doyle kept his nerve. Wrong way. Oh, here's Declan. Oh, just to the left post again. He looks so suave and debonair when he puts that ball on the spot. Oh, my God. He just blew that through our new keeper. Played it right behind where he was. Oh, here's Wardley. Come on. Come on, Wardley. Think of all those years you were here at Ballatown. No, that's not what you were supposed to be thinking. Oh, there's a lot of new guys here, man. Oh, he drills it in. Oh, man. Oh, right to the post, man. Oh, the pressure's on here. The pressure is on. Who's stepping up for this one? Oh, it's Bimba, our new player. Oh, no. A lot of new players here. It's all on him. Oh, he places it in calm as could be. Perfect five for five for both clubs. I'm assuming we go to a second group of five, right? Oh, you should have saved that one. You should have saved. Now, is it a second group of five or is it a one to one? Does it just alternate until you win? Oh, this is just brutal. Woods, our left back. Oh, he squeezed it in the small window. Whew. Whew. Burroughs lines up for Colwyn Bay. Oh, it's a save! <laughs> it's a save. Opportunity has not. Uh, Saxton. Somebody's home. Sorry, guys. Bo. It's in. And we win. Yes. Oh, it goes to sudden death at that point. Oh, my goodness. Whoo. And you know what's odd? I4 never lined up for a penalty, did he? I4 never lined up for the penalty. That is crazy. Uh, we're going to go we're going to go passionate. A good win. I mean, you know, you dug down, you showed some testicular fortitude. I think that was huge. Wow. Here we go. Yeah, I4 I4 never took a penalty. I mean, granted his sucks, but is that odd that your strikers have the worst penalty ability on the club? Well, that's a debut to remember. You give up 6 goals counting penalties and you make give up an own goal but then you make two big stops. Wow, that is insane. Well, that was enough for one episode, I suppose, because we have gone over with everything else that we had. Let's come back for uh, Cardiff and, eh, you know what? Let's come back for Jan Dudno and Druids. Mm. <coughs> I'm going to come back for Druids and Oppenlido. That's a new club. So newly promoted. Let's do that. So we'll come back. That'll give us a long run of games here. 
and we can, you know, I can work on the tactics and see what's going on, but I think that's a big win. Guys, hit that like button, subscribe, and we'll see you next episode. Take care. Bye.